hello beautiful people welcome to my channel this is Tino Ola and today I will be showing you how I was able to get this strong natural coarse hair into a more soft texturized hair if you want to see stay tuned I will be using the Oli Miracle texturizer this is my first time using this so I'm a little bit skeptical but let's see how it goes so I'll be unboxing this and we have all of that inside and a guide spatula and glove shampoo pre-treatment cream texturizer cream itself and a deep conditioning treatment now let's get started first thing is the step one that's the guide I need it says I should use the glove so let's open this bad boy and wear the glove Ooh, the glove is actually very good. This is large. <sighs> Step two says to apply the pre-treatment cream on the roots of my hair. What I'll be doing is sectioning my hair into four sections in order to apply the pre-treatment cream with easy accessibility Honey, what does perfect even mean is there even such a thing oh, oh. Can we I'm trying to get out this pre-treatment cream and it's taking so long applying it on my roots as instructed Just applying to all the four sections. And I'm massaging my scalp. Guys, it feels so good. So I'm gonna twist that and just keep it aside and continue on the other three sections. Yo, this is hard to get out. Once I finish up the second section, I will do the other two and I will be back. Yes, I'm back. Here is the progress so far. Now I'll be using the texturizer cream itself. Guys, it feels like a relaxer. Like this reminds me of times when I was a child and you know, our mamas, they would always want to relax our hair because that was what was in vogue. They felt that was the best way they could take care of our hair, so we would always get our hair relaxed, even as early as uh, an eight-year-old child. But relaxers taught me a different thing, <laughs> not good for my hair. So today I'm just using the texturizer to soften my curls because they are actually very strong curls and it can be difficult to maintain sometimes. After applying the first round of the texturizer, I'm gonna put that section away and do the other sections. Now I'm done with all the sections. 
but I still have some texturizers left in the bottle so I'm gonna go through the sections again of course you want to be economy wise you don't want to waste any products so guys we're doing it again making sure that the strands are tangled detangled and they are soft enough guys you want to walk through all the strands make sure everything is fully coated with a texturizer and like i said i don't want to change my natural hair that's not the purpose of using this texturizer i just want to make my hair soft softer than it used to it used to be and that's why i'm applying the texturizer on my hair i'm not gonna let it stay for a long time because if i do it's going to change the nature of my hair so texturizers and relaxers are pretty much similar almost the same you want to apply the texturizers on your hairline and your edges to make sure everything is covered also a quick tip guys if you have a sensitive scalp make sure you apply a petroleum jelly or vaseline something that would coat the um, edges of your hair to your ear and also the edges in between where you divide the hair Just combing through to make sure everything is proper, properly detangled and I will be going straight into the shower to wash this bad boy off my hair. I'm rinsing my hair thoroughly to get the treatment out. Using the shampoo to wash my hair, rinse off and use the deep conditioner to Condition my hair for five minutes before I wash off. Here's me coming out of the shower. Hair's clean. Now let's do this. I'll be using the Monet leave in conditioner to moisturize my hair. Using the curl cream just to give my hair more curl definition. This cream doesn't really work for me, but um, I'm not planning to have a look that looks too curly. If that makes sense, I just wanna kind of have an afro look, so I don't really want my curls to be too defined. Right now, I'm just doing a flat twist to ensure my hair is in place and keep the moisture in as I go to bed. Alright, now let's get this hair in shape.
I'm applying the aloe vera gel on my edges to just lay them down. No baby hair because my hair does not do baby hair. I'm just going to let it do its thing, you know. Okay, here we are. I'm so excited. I got the result I wanted. A soft, natural, 4C hair. I am so happy and if you guys enjoyed this video why don't you put it in the comment box below you can also like the video share and turn on the notification bell so you're notified every time I share a video thanks for watching you take care see you soon bye